Because I'm, I'm thinking of my decision to no longer seek romance with women in my life. And um, I'm wondering about it and um, I'm thinking it's been a while, some weeks I would say, and I still think it is the right thing for me to do. And I'm thinking that there are two main reasons why I've decided this. And I suppose if the main one, the first one is um, that I don't want to have more children. And I wouldn't be able to have control of that situation. I'm not keen on condoms and they could fail anyway. The issue is control of pregnancy. And I'm not happy with the situation where I couldn't control that. So I don't want to take the risk of more children. And so the only thing I can do is to not have sex. Now that's obviously a cost to me in enjoyment of life. But I will do it because I don't want to be a father again. I don't see that I have a choice. And the other reason is I don't want to be vulnerable to false allegations of acting improperly, of rape basically. It seems to me that um, whenever a man has sex with a woman, he is vulnerable to being accused of essentially being a rapist, of having sex with her against her will. It does seem as if society views sex as an activity that women grant to men. Women allow a man access to have sex. A woman is essentially doing the man a favour. It is not an equal activity. The man is being allowed access. The woman, the woman is granting him access. And so this is why men are vulnerable to being accused of behaving improperly regarding sex because sex is not viewed as an equal activity. Men are seen to be the active agents and women are, women can be abused easily, easily by men. A woman is seen as the object Men are seen as the agents. A woman is passive and the man is in, in, in control. So I'm not happy with this view of sex and I'm not happy to be vulnerable to being falsely accused basically. It seems to me that whenever a man has sex with a woman, he is automatically vulnerable to being accused of having sex with her against her will, of being a rapist, essentially. I don't see a way a man can have sex with a woman without being vulnerable to false allegation. I realise this is a negative view of the whole business, but it does seem to be true.